having fun. A woman is beautiful because that is a hard question. Why? What? <laughs> That's a loaded question. Because they're the reason that expire meant to exist. It's a flow of things that make us write poetry, that make us fall in love, that make us stay focused, that give us a reason to live. That's why they're beautiful. Because they're there. She has an incredible capacity to love. She's able to express her beauty how she chooses. When they embrace each other, they are um, committed and loyal. They have a lot of empathy towards other people and just overall I feel like we're just loving, loving people. Because she got the quality that man doesn't. Because the juice love. Because her spirit is beautiful. Can conquer the world. <laughs> she has a great personality. She's sexy. <laughs> They're the backbones of society. If all because we are powerful and multitasking. And because we bring a lot to each other, we help each other, and I think that makes us very beautiful as well. Because she's the most beautiful mother in the world. Women are the completing piece to the male factor, and that is why they are beautiful. Women are beautiful for the same reason that anything is beautiful. It's because you're alive, and you're here, and you have the strength and the ability to do so many things that men cannot do. Woman is beautiful because she has power. Women are beautiful because of how they embody themselves. I think confidence is beauty. Like once you don't worry about what other people think about you, then you're confident and you think you're beautiful yourself. So it doesn't matter what other people have to say. The femininity of a woman and how different we can all be in the sense of our personalities. A woman had their own little thing that makes them beautiful. So there is no real meaning of beautiful because there's so many ways to put it. And they're just the creators of everything. Because of what they contribute to the world. We are very mature, we're very hardworking. If you can see um, her heart come out of her when she interacts with people. And, uh, to me that's, that's true. Probably because they're so much stronger than men. They like build the people in the community. Like, no man in this world will be who they are today without a woman in front of them. They are the yin to the yang of men. Without women, there's no definition of man and vice versa. How you interact with someone, you know? That's that's in my eyes what makes a woman beautiful. Uh, every woman are beautiful because of. Uh, uh, Yeah, Women come in all different shapes, colors, sizes. Like, I think they're all beautiful. Like people in general, but women definitely. Because they are a symbol of comfort and nurture and just their softness relative to the hardness of men. Because what's in here? Not all this or that, it's just here. And because they're themselves and they work to be beautiful. But it really comes down to this. That a woman has. Why are women beautiful? Well, there's a couple of reasons. Um, you know, I think every guy is going to start with the physical, but uh, I think, you know, women are just emotionally and mentally beautiful. It's sometimes scary to me because <laughs> I, I don't always understand. A woman is your mom, is your sister, is your wife. You know, there are multiple roles, so it's really, really difficult to. You know, assign a role to them. It's just one person who can be anything. We're very strong, like we can go through a lot of um, trials and still triumph. Women are beautiful for countless different reasons. I think that there are so many different complex things about us that just makes us unique. A woman is beautiful because she's God's greatest gift to earth. She's able to reproduce and give back. They're kind and thoughtful and nurturing. Because we are beautiful. If not on the outside, then the inside of the That's what it is. Because they are. Is there any reason? <laughs> Because they are themselves. When they are truly themselves, that makes them beautiful. To depend on anybody and their comfort.
confident in their own skin. I don't know why women are beautiful, they just are. Even if they don't have a makeup, they still look pretty. We wear our hearts on our sleeves. I say that because um, oftentimes people try to hide their emotions. And I feel like women, we just hold space for everything that we feel. And that may be look, looked at as powerless, but I think that exerts power and strength. We give life and we give love. It's a different kind of love, a woman's love. So I feel like that's part of the beauty, because it's, it's different. It's something that only women can give. Based on their femininity, like I think feminine energy is something that is the essence of beauty. A matter of one's own opinion, so I feel as though if a woman feels she's beautiful and carries herself as such, then she's beautiful. Why are you beautiful? Oh, I don't know if I'm beautiful. <laughs> that I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I, uh, I'm beautiful. Well, I don't know if I'm beautiful or not. They say beauty is in the eye of the beholder. What if the beholder is you? The standard definition of beauty is an outstanding example of its kind. Most women feel that they don't fall under that definition. Instead, a new unachievable definition is created, a new goal is set, and the race to beauty begins. I will be honored to meet this beauty you speak of, this beauty you praise, this non-tangible prize at the end of this godforsaken race. Once you reach that finish line, will your beauty now be redefined? With the countless concealers, foundations, blushes, and lipsticks, browners, liners, bronzers, and brushes, all of this makeup just to make up for what you don't have. Beauty is not something that can be bought. It is something that could be taught. Take a seat and make sure you take notes, for changing every part of you will not make you beautiful. It will make you store-bought. Is it beauty you seek or approval? Approval from the people who you consider beautiful. Art, you are the epitome of its existence. The female body in all of its femininity. Your beauty is not defined by your clothing size. It is defined by all the layers inside. Women, we are our biggest critics. You are more than what the mirror reflects. Mirrors have its defects. You only see what you want to see, it is flaw. What you see is what you feel. What you feel is what you think. So this philosophy, I advise you. I think, therefore I am. Believe you are beautiful and you will be. You're too fat, you're too skinny, too thin, you're not worthy. Are all just words unless you give them meaning. You try not to think about it, but eventually, an unappealing feeling begins to surround you. The burden of loneliness starts to overwhelm you, so you. Then lace will prompt the one you desire to see you as desirable. But now you are enlaced in doubt and shame because he left you. Now you wonder if you still have the dignity to ask him, am I beautiful? Don't fall in your pool of self-judgment, for you don't know how to swim. Without confidence to keep you afloat, you will sink. You may close your eyes and hold your breath, but your insecurities will anchor. Once you accept yourself, that anchor will detach. Although the current of self-disapproval is strong, self-confidence is enough to allow you to reach the surface. Believe in your beauty no matter what the mirror reflects. Don't dive in shallow water. It will not allow you to flow. But find the deepest ocean and plunge into it because you are more than worth it. I find it interesting that women distance themselves from the word beautiful. All of the characteristics used to define what makes a woman beautiful to them does not apply. Why do they feel separate from the woman they idolize? What if the definition of beauty was redefined? I'm beautiful because this is how I was made by God. Because I'm happy with myself. I accept myself for who I am. I myself am a mixed person. I feel like I'm mixed between Eastern and Western. Um, Eastern and Western um, views, and I'm beautiful because I have a mix of the world in me. Because I take pride in myself. One thing, I'm a passionate, driven person. I don't need other people's opinions to validate who I am. Because I openly accept myself for who I am, 
and every day I work towards being the woman I choose to become. With everything that I have to go through in life period, I still find a reason and a way to smile. I'm beautiful because I'm me. I don't try to be anybody else. I don't really need someone else's opinion to, um, to you know, to validate my beauty. I'm beautiful because I have a great heart. Because I'm a good person. I feel like I'm a strong person, so I guess that makes me beautiful too. I'm beautiful, I think, overall, because of my friends that are there. <laughs> and because all the things I've experienced in my life. I'm, I'm beautiful because I'm me and I like being myself. I care about people and I kind of do what I want in the sense of like, I like to express myself uh, through my style, through my art, through like who I am. I know my flaws and I use my flaws to be my strength and that's why I'm beautiful. I've overcome a lot in life and I've, I feel like I've gotten places and yeah that makes me strong and as a result beautiful. I think intelligence makes you even more beautiful. How I am in the world, like I think my kindness towards other people. I'm beautiful because I'm a good person. I'm a good person to um, just everyone. Because I'm down to earth and I'm humble to everyone. I'm beautiful because I'm a mix of so many experiences and so many wonderful people who taught me the things that I needed to live life as happily and as honestly as possible. And God made me and God is beautiful. Because I'm awesome. <laughs> Because I'm myself and I'm not like everyone else. I'm different. <laughs> because I believe within myself that I'm beautiful. And anything that I think I emulate. And I strive like to better myself every single day and help people around me. Like my own beauty is kind of like me admiring myself and it sounds egotistical, but egotistical, but um, I think it's really important for you to have that kind of confidence. And... It's because I get to I, I, I get to learn every day and I feel like it makes you beautiful now about yourself, about others, and about how you interact with others. I think that's what makes me beautiful. And why are you beautiful? Why am I beautiful? Well, because I'm a woman. The true definition of beauty is you. Women are beautiful. She is beautiful. And you are beautiful.